High winds also brought down trees in New Jersey. CBS News' Alice Gaynor is live in Leonia with a look at the damage there. Alice. A large portion of Broad Avenue and its side streets remain closed. And here's why, Mary. Utility poles and wires, those are down. Trees are also down here as well. This is the central business district, so a lot of these businesses are closed right now. The police chief here in Leonia tells me at the height of the storm, eight to 10 streets were closed, which he says is worse than normal during a storm. There were, however, limited power outages. Now, we've got some drone footage courtesy of Leonia police, a massive tree down resting on a home. He he says two trees actually fell on homes here in town, but there was only minimal damage, so people did not have to evacuate their homes. We've got another look from the sky of the utility poles down on Broad Avenue and a look from the ground as well. I actually spoke with a nearby resident. He showed us the damage on his property after a canopy structure on his deck blew onto his neighbor's property. It was up on top of that. And somehow the wind blew it up over here. Never had that trouble before. Yeah. It's been up for 12 years, maybe a little longer. So was there a car in this driveway? No, thank God they parked their cars over there. Leonia Middle School is closed today, but the high school and elementary schools remain open. Thankfully, the police chief says, despite all of this damage, so far, no reports of any injuries. Live in Leonia, Bergen County, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News.